And yeah, we found more along the way. Um, I think the plan is straight back round the battery. I was going to go further on, but it's a bit busy. It's not for me. Nowhere to go. Cheers. no choice but to go out what what's actually going to be happening about the the appointment that you guys missed is, is it gonna to have to be rebooked I mean that'd be another four weeks then wouldn't it 
just just forget it this is this is like torturing patients this is like torture this this appointment this morning was because the previous one had been cancelled so i'm now without treatment for in excess of eight weeks and you're saying i'll have to book again that'll be another month um it's like I, there is no nhs for me anymore none at all i'm i'm just appalled i'm just appalled all i want to know is is there any thing come from the endoscopy that i had if there's nothing if there's nothing come of that then i'm back to square one with no treatment for about three years now this is i i'm having a go at you i don't mean to i do apologize but i am disgusted this is like torture now i am being tortured to death i appreciate your call thank you very much for the call goodbye That was the hospital. We're very apologetic. We'll have to rebook it. We're taking the piss, aren't we? The sooner we're dead, mate, the better. The sooner we're dead, the better. Where was I? Let's get out of here. <laughs> what I didn't do was a chime check I was so flipping angry it's, it's, it's not so much anger it's despair you know I feel so unwell every day every day I feel so unwell and it's gonna be worse tomorrow every day for about three years now and I get a phone call oh sorry we didn't have the appointment we'll have to rebook it flipping Christ's sake Uh, comes four reasons out down from the ferry pontoon. So if we hesitate here, we may get a shot for reasons.
okay, they're out. Okay. Uh, so is the sun actually. It's all coming and going. The race close to me. Close. Lock for a while. Quite surprised by that. Very sleepy. <laughs> 